Hello future engineers, welcome to my YouTube channel. If you're still new to my channel, don't forget to share my videos if you like them to your friends and to your friends' friends. And if you haven't yet subscribed, as long as you like what I'm doing by creating videos, then don't forget to subscribe. That's the only way you can help me refreshed and keep me going keep me going so here is another example on frames by energy methods for the frame shown determine the vertical displacement at c by Cassegrain's second theorem and the horizontal displacement at d by virtual work method ei is constant so first let's solve for reaction at d by summing up moments about a and of course we apply a vertical force p at c because this is by Cassegrain's second theorem. So make sure moment A equals zero. So RD times seven plus P times four minus 40 times four minus 30 times four times two. So RD in terms of B and the uh, constant reaction is 400 minus four P over seven. So let's apply it here. Then summation forces x, we have ax 40 to the left. Summation forces y equals 0. So ay plus p plus 400 minus 4p over 7 minus 30 times 4 equals 0. So you just verify this. ay is 400 minus 3p over 7. Anyway, section ab in this manner and AY has no moment contribution there. It passes through that section. So we section CD beginning at D in this manner. Take note that the slope, the length of this member is 5 because the slope is 3 horizontal for vertical. So the length is 5 meters. Therefore, the component of X horizontally and vertically would be X times 3 over 5 or 0.6x and this is 0.8x as shown then here section and we since there are so many forces involved if we consider all forces above and to the right of the section so we we shift the sectioning here and let's consider forces below that section so for the first section, EI delta C vertical equals integral from 0 to 5 of quantity 400 minus 4P over 7 times 0.6X. The derivative is negative 4 times 0.6X over 7 and that is reduced to negative 12X over 35 EX. Then in this section, the moment is quant integral from 0 to 4 of quantity 400 minus 4p over 7 times 3 plus x plus p times x then minus 30 times x times x over 2 or minus 15 x squared. Then the derivative is negative 4 over 7, 3 plus x plus x. Derivative of this moment equation. And finally, in this, in this section, the moment is simply 40 times x, but because the derivative is 0, because it is not a function of p, so it is 0. So we don't consider that section anymore. So dropping p, setting p to 0, and evaluating manually using your scratch, 0 to 5, the value of the first integral is negative 489.796. So this is integral of 400 over 7 times 3 plus x and minus 15 x squared because p is ignored times this expression in simplified form. So the second integral is negative 711.867. Combining so delta C vertical is negative 1202 over EI or it is downward. Next, by virtual work method, 
So the reaction here would be ignore P, 400 over 7, because there's no P here by virtual work. Then this is 440 over 3 and 40. For 40 over 7 and 40 kilonewtons left part. So same sectioning. And due to virtual force, we apply a unit virtual load at D horizontally, as shown. So if we sum up moment about A, reaction times 7 minus 1 times 0 because the unit virtual load passes through A, it has no moment, so the reaction here is 0. Vertical reaction here is also 0, and the horizontal reaction is 1 to the left. So therefore, in this section, the moment, so remember, mamma mia, integral of mamma mia, big M, small m, dx over EI. So EI, horizontal displacement at T, equals integral of quantity 400 over 7 times 0.6x, then 1 times 0.8x due to virtual force at that section. Then in this section, plus integral 0 to 4 of 400 over 7 times 3 plus x then minus 15 x square then due to virtual load it is just 1 times 4 horizontal so moment arm is 4 meters so 1 times 4 finally here we have integral of 40 times x then small m is 1 times x, 0 to 4, dx from 0 to 4, because EI is constant, it is here. So the first integral is 1142.857, the second integral is 3291.49, and the third is 853. 853.333 so I would suggest that if you find it fast of course you have to post the video then evaluate by yourselves that expression then post again evaluate verify these values so delta dh is equal to 5288 over ei and that's it for this problem